strategy. Strategy. Do you like think one movie or TV show, cartoon, especially cartoon that you like to watch? Can okay, you think of one? You get it in English. Get the DVD. DVDs are very cheap in Vietnam. <laughs> if you can't buy one DVD, I will help you. <laughs> okay, it's very cheap. Buy one DVD. You buy the English version and buy the Vietnamese version. Now you can do exactly the same thing. You can watch in Vietnamese, watch in English, again and again. Practice listening to the English and try to dictation. Try to write it. And especially the, if you buy the DVD, um, you know they have the subtitle. You can put the English subtitle. Yeah. They have choice, right? Usually most DVD on the is like Chinese, English, sometimes Vietnamese, Thai. Yeah. So, but they always have English choice. Put the English subtitles. So you listen to English, read English. And you can watch in Vietnamese. If you're a very dedicated student, you can read the English subtitle, stop.
you record 30 minutes of TV, something, a you know, TV show, documentary film, or if you buy the DVD, you watch 30 minutes Monday, Tuesday you watch the same 30 minutes, watch the same 30 minutes. One week? Yeah, maybe for one week, every day, for, for one week. It's much better. But when you start the DVD the first day, start at the beginning. Second day, start in the middle. St always start in a different place because otherwise your brain will get tired at the same place. The first 10 minutes you'll know very well and the second 10 minutes you don't know. So every day listen to the same 30 minutes but start at a different place each day. I have a habit that uh, when I do morning exercise, yeah. I can uh, turn, uh, turn on the loud speaker. Yeah. It's uh, speak uh, some English. Yeah. Uh, that is a good method. That's good. That's really good. Sure, sure. When you, especially when you're exercising at home, you can listen to the English. And when I'm exercising, I learn Vietnamese. So. <laughs> Very good. Um, okay, for your teaching, for your teaching, those of you, you're going to be teaching foreigners now. Hopefully we get many customers now. They see the video. Okay. When you're teaching Vietnamese, I think the best thing is you still, let's say you have one and a half hour lesson with your foreigner student. One and a half hour lesson. Most of that time you spend with the book Traditional Learning. Because the foreigner, he's living in Hanoi. He needs to be able to buy things, to drive the moto, to Live. He needs to speak Vietnamese very quickly, some Vietnamese very quickly. And if he doesn't, at the end of three weeks or four weeks, if he doesn't know anything, he will not continue with you. He'll go to a different teacher. So you need to make sure that he's learning traditional so they can communicate. At the end of one month or two months or three months, he should be able to communicate. So if you have one and a half hour lesson, one minute, a one hour and ten minutes, can spend on traditional learning. 20 minutes you can work on a story like this. So what you can do, teacher, you can, on the notebook, on the, just, you know, because you don't have a whiteboard. When you're meeting your foreigner student, you don't have a whiteboard. So just use paper on the table, put a piece of paper, just put a paper and tell the story, whatever it is. Okay, tell the story and draw the story. Okay. The first time you do this, practice at home first. Practice at home first. And keep the story very, very simple story. This story is a very nice story, but it's very advanced. This is intermediate level story. Okay. So for a beginner story, very, very, very simple story. Very simple. You draw on the paper, and every day at the end of every lesson, take about, stories should take about three minutes to tell, and then ask questions in English, do you understand, what is this, what is this, tell the story again in Vietnamese, so we need listening. Yeah, I need 800 hours of listening. In my lesson, still we do many things in English, because of this, I don't understand, you have to explain, you have to translate, so I'm not getting I have lesson, Vietnamese lesson every day, 1.5 hours, but the listening value is probably 20 minutes. The listening value is probably only 20 minutes because we still use a lot of English in my Vietnamese lesson. Also, I'm talking. Even I'm speaking Vietnamese, but that's not listening. So when your student is talking, he's actually not learning. He needs to listen. So I'm probably only getting 20 minutes of listening every day, and I need 800 hours. I need 800 hours. So it's going to take 2,400 hours. It's going to take 2,800, 2,400 hours for me to get my 800 hours of listening. <laughs> 